This is Denver 7 On Demand. Good morning, I'm Molly Hendrickson with the latest from Denver 7. Tonight, a heartbroken and devastated community will gather to pay tribute to a murdered mother and two girls. A vigil will be held outside the home of the Watts family in Frederick at 8.30. A memorial is already in place outside the home. It continues to grow with teddy bears, flowers, and handwritten messages. This morning, officials issued more evacuation orders because of the Silver Creek fire that's burning north of Kremlin. Lightning sparked this fire nearly a month ago and since then it's grown to more than 4,000 acres. It's only 5% contained. And just within the past 24 hours, those living in the Old Park and Gore Lakes communities were also told to leave. Tomorrow is a great day to adopt a new pet. A dozen shelters in Colorado are waiving their normal adoption fees as part of a program called Clear the Shelters. They have adoptable cats, kittens, puppies, rabbits, and guinea pigs all for free. We have a list of the participating shelters right now on our free Denver 7 app. And now from the First Alert Weather Center, here is Lisa Hidalgo. It is now, well, it's a pretty nice start to our day. We've got this afternoon, though, a chance for some thunderstorms. Uh, we'll see this afternoon our highs in the mid to upper 80s, so it's going to be a pretty warm day today. The difference compared to yesterday is that we will get a few storms and a slight risk that one or two of these could turn strong, likely east of I-25. Tomorrow is going to be a different story. Now, today's risk of marginal weather does include portions of I-25, but mainly east from there where we could get some larger hail and some wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour. Tomorrow, rain is likely. Thunderstorms are possible as we get a cold front rolling in. Temperatures will drop. We'll be in the mid 80 Saturday and behind that front on Sunday, it's going to be quite a bit cooler. 78 for a high on Sunday. So with this storm rolling in, we have issued a first alert action day going into effect on Saturday. 78 Sunday in Molly. Look how cool it is early Monday morning. I'm a wimp. I'll probably put the heat on in my car early Monday. 52 for a low. All right. Thanks, Lisa. This has been your Denver 7 On Demand update. Thanks for joining us and check back here later this morning for another update and download the free Denver 7 app for breaking news and alerts. I'm Molly Hendrickson.